What's up guys, Prime Blast here and welcome back to another Islands video. Today in this video, I'm going to give you a full walkthrough on how to finish all your quests and get all the doubloons and buy that treasure map. So before I start, please remember to smash the subscribe button and turn on that notification bell if you want to watch more videos like this. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so firstly to get to the pirate island, all you need to do is to go through the hub and then turn left immediately and just follow, follow this walkway all the way to like a pirate ship over there. And you go past the totem cellar or whatever you call it and there you go. So there will be a Hana which is the pirate captain and you talk to it and you will say would you like to travel to the pirate island press travel to pirate island and there you go this is a new pirate island that they just updated so as you can see there's a lot of NPC here so let's start with the first one which is the slayer pirate talk, you need to talk to it you can eat a real shop as you can see that's the bone which you can get from I think eliminating all the I think pirates and you also got the crystallized iron crystallized obsidian I mean which I'm about to show you in the other quest and lastly the obsidian hilt I think that's what you call it but you need to press real quest and as you can see this, this is all defeat you can you need to defeat bandits and crabs so now let's go and get a weapon you can either get this like a spell weapon like the spell book or the Kong staff or you can use melee weapon like the Kong's axe or like the sword and stuff like that I can't remember so we got this we got the cutlass I think the rage blade is the best weapon I think so let's let's use that okay so to find this all these bandits is really easy you go into this like jungle and as you can see this is all the bandits that you have to kill there you go I think they don't do that much damage you can see I'm still on full damage and there you go I got two bones and then so I got some light melee XP and also combat XP as you can see they only do 12 12, da uh, 12 damage so that's really easy to eliminate them all so if you want if they are bundled up together you can use the spell spell books so that you can eliminate them all together like right here as you can see there's crabs there, and there's bandits so the cra crabs a bit harder to kill I think they have 30 they can deal 30 damage and they also drop sand they drop coconuts they drop seagrass and stuff like that as you can see I got a gold from killing one of the bandits so as you can see they are all bundle up together so I'm gonna take out my spell book right here I'm gonna take out my spell books and I think they patched it so now we can use it yep there you go and right now the best the best food to heal up is the suffered cake so remember to eat that when you're healing up so there you go I just healed up a lot about 60 I think Okay, so there you go, let's eliminate them all, let's finish one quest and let's head on to the other one. I think we'll, we'll kill all this and then we'll, we can go and f claim our doubloons. As you can see I also got yellow corals from killing the crabs and that's, I think that's all you, you'll get. So there you go, let's kill this la one last one and we can go claim up the balloons. now as you can see I also got a bone block I think that's what you can also get from killing the bandits so let's head over to the slayer pirate as you can see it topples over and then let's go to view quest and we can claim these 5 doubloons so I need to de defeat 18 more crabs 1 more bandits and six more bandits i think no seven more bandits adding them all up together 
So now let's head over to the minor pirate. Now we have to land a hand, we need to uh, break obsidian blocks. So if you guys not, don't know where obsidian blocks is, I'm about to show you. Then you get your pickaxe, you need to head over to that giant volcano, volcano right in the middle of the island. So there should be some right here. And I think this is one right here. I don't think you guys can see that well. So let's see. Just like this. Doesn't work that much. But it looks like all the normal ores, but it's 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 black. So you can use this instead of using the slate box or the coal blocks. So there you go, there's one more here. Let's break that. And if you're lucky, you can also get crystallized obsidian and yeah and then you can I think craft different tools and weapons with the crystallized obsidian I think that's what you can do with it so that's not the obsidian it's more over here and there you go I just got a crystallized obsidian I'll just show you guys after I mine all the obsidian and let's go crease the nice obsidian and this is what it looks like guys it's just uh it's just like the crystallized iron and go crystallized gold but it's black so let's go and go ahead and mine more obsidians there you go there you go and i think that will be that will that will be enough so let's look at the obsidian there you go i got 50 obsidian and this is this just looks like the coal block before it's been updated. So let's head back to the miner, the miner pirate, and claim our doubloons. Okay, so here we are. Let's, I think we can claim one of them. There you go. We just need to uh, mine 18. I mean, no, not 18 more. We just need to mine more obsidian blocks. So let's go over to the fisherman pirate, which is the next quest that we'll need to finish. And caught any fish for me. As you can see, you can sell like the added sharks and also puffer fish to the game. Let's sell the shark for 400 and the puffer fish for 50. So I need a real quest. And the quest is catch fish from the pirate island river. And also need to capture puffer fish and sharks. So I'm not sure how to get the sharks. I, I reckon you all you need to do is just fish for them. Right here. I think that's all you need to do. And I think that's how you can get the shark. So I'm just gonna get my iron fishing rod. Try not to use the fish, the wooden fishing rod because uh, the iron one can, I think, makes the chances chances higher of getting the sharks or puffer fish. Oh, and there you go, guys! I just got a shark right here. I'm just gonna show you guys right now. And there you go. This is how the shark looks like. So I'm actually not gonna sell this shark because it looks cool and I think you can actually put it in a fish tank so this is a kiwi fruit we'll get back to that later on but let's go ahead and capture another fish right here and try and get a puffer fish there you go got a red snapper and if you can't remember a great way of getting uh, getting a better fish is I mean, get it. a great way of catching a fish fast is just going under the fish and just cast your your fishing rod right under it. So let's find another fish. I think we have already finished one of the quests of getting capturing a shark. So let's head back and claim our plate the balloons. I think that's what they call it. So let's go over here and. Let's claim this the balloons and there we go. So now 
let's head over to the next one, which is the protagonist pirate. So you've been picking any kiwis up? The kiwi, uh, they keep the scurvy away. So I think that's some kind of saying, but I'm not sure. So in your real quest, you pick up 15 kiwi fruits. So from what I know, I just saw like a, a kiwi tree over there. I think that's how the kiwi tree looks like. So you go over there. Right here, I think there's three kiwi fruits over here. Two and three. Now I think there will be more kiwi tree or saplings around the island. I think you look for uh, it. Look, you look for trees that looks like that. So this one, all of this I think is the coconut trees. So it's not any kiwi trees. So there you go. That's another one right there. So you just need to go around the island and collect all of the different. Collect from all the different trees. So there I go, three more. Okay, there I go. I think we need to collect uh from collect kiwi from I think three more saplings. Yep. So let's go over here. There's there's one over here and also there's crabs around. You can also try and defeat all these crabs to finish one of your quests from the Slayer Pirate. So now I can just uh, make like a time lapse so you guys don't need to watch me just walking around doing nothing. So I'll do a time lapse right now. Alright guys, so as you can see, this is the last one I need, I think. And this is just not far from the protagonist. I think, that, I think that's how you pronounce it. So I think now we can finally finish the quest. And there you go, 20 doubloons. So once you have finished all the quests, I, I, do, I don't know if it adds up to 120 or not. You can come over to this pirate Davy over here. And you can talk to it and you can buy a treasure map. I think this leads to like, I think a buried treasure or I think a buried sword. I don't know what it is. But I will try and grind to 120 doubloons. And I'm going to show you what the buried treasure is. So that is it for the video. If you did enjoy the video, please remember to smash the subscribe button. And turn on that notification bell so you never miss any more videos like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.